Who is the engineer of tomorrow? In a world where change is exponential, where change is the only constant, we must also change the conversation about engineering, about who we are, what we do, and what we look like. Our engineers must embody agility and resilience, competence and character, the qualities that create trust. As USC Engineering entered its 115th year, the last 16 under the Viterbi name, the school was moving with confident strides to help engineer a better world for all humanity. And then, humanity was confronted with an unthinkable crisis. Breaking news tonight, the coronavirus forcing millions more Schools Americans into virtual lockdown. Over 75 million people in New York, California, Illinois, and Connecticut. Illinois, and Connecticut. As the surge of coronavirus cases explodes. In the face of crisis, USC Viterbi adjusted, innovated, and continued to lead. Nearly 50 years ago, Viterbi pioneered an online course system known today as DEN at Viterbi, the Distance Education Network. DEN has been consistently named by U.S. News & World Report as one of the top five online graduate engineering programs in the country with its computer science and technology program ranked number one for the ninth consecutive year. This agility and resilience also led the Viterbi faculty to address the pandemic in a deeply meaningful way. The Viterbi versus Pandemics Lecture Series is a groundbreaking effort that summarizes Viterbi faculty research and the development of new methods to predict, analyze, and combat COVID-19, with topics ranging from the fluid dynamics of contagion to risk estimation and vaccine development. Character also means fighting the pandemic head-on. Viterbi, a co-founder of the Grand Challenges Scholars Program, co-conceived and is helping lead the NAE's COVID-19 call for engineering action. Students, faculty, and engineers across the country contribute to a virtual incubator of ideas with the goal of mitigating the contagion and its impact. This year, a record six assistant professors at USC Viterbi received the prestigious National Science Foundation Career Award. Megan McCain and Matul Lahar, Alexandra Korolova and Hai Peng Lo, and Daniel McCurry and Jimming Wong. Scott Frazier, jointly with the Dornsife College, was inducted into the National Academy of Medicine. Azad Madni and Zhang Shi Peng were elected to the National Academy of Engineers. Keith Chug, Jay Kuo, and Gerald Lowe were elected to the National Academy of Inventors, and Gigi Ragusa received the Presidential Mentoring Award for Science and Engineering. The extraordinary competence of Viterbi's engineers also includes work such as that of Professor Ava Conso, who used a groundbreaking study of the locomotion in sea stars to help design simpler decentralized systems in robotics. Assistant Professor Mariam Shinechi developed an interface that maps how emotional disorders are represented in the brain, promising new therapies to change the state of mental health. And Professor Krishna Nayak has led an initiative to build a revolutionary, high-performance, low-field MRI center in Michelson Hall, only the third of its kind in the world. Competence also means looking toward the future. Despite the obstacles presented by COVID-19, we are looking forward to the ceremonial groundbreaking for the Ginsburg Human-Centered Computation Building, a 100,000-square-foot state-of-the-art facility focused on human-centered computation. This year also marked the opening of the Baum Family Makerspace, a unique multi-purpose center for designing and fabrication by USC Viterbi students. It includes an open design space, a fully staffed machine shop, and a 3D fabrication shop. In this cauldron of innovation, students from all the school's design and competition teams can work side by side, under one roof, cultivating a mindset of growth where leadership, creativity, and collaboration across the disciplines will endure and prevail. But beyond resilience and competence, the engineer of tomorrow requires character. The Viterbi Ethos Project is dedicated to building a sense of ethical responsibility and purpose in our students, helping them understand their role in society and their place in history. 
the Engineering Humanities program will offer a liberal arts curriculum that is holistically integrated with Viterbi's technical schools. It will instill in our students a desire to practice engineering virtuously. The character of our engineers was tested in 2020, not only by the pandemic, but by a reckoning with some of the darkest chapters of our history. Once again, Viterbi stepped up to lead by pursuing a historic series of initiatives focused on diversity, equity, and inclusion. A 2017 ASEE award-winning National Diversity Pledge has gained the signatures of over 230 engineering deans nationwide. A podcasting series, Escape Velocity, focuses on the intersection of race, academia, and STEM, and features the poignant stories of Viterbi's Black faculty, students, and staff. And Viterbi's parody objective aims to enhance diversity in all parts of the engineering pipeline, from K through 12, to undergraduate admissions, to faculty recruitment. Diversity drives innovation, and Viterbi is proud to help lead the engineering community into a bigger, bolder, and more inclusive future. When we look back on 2020, we will remember a year of great challenges. But in the post-COVID era, a new generation of engineers will lead us forward. The engineer of tomorrow is the Viterbi engineer, an engineer who builds trust through agility, resilience, competence, and character, who uses technology to eliminate distances in space and time, but most importantly, in hearts and minds. There will always be problems, but all problems are solvable if we work together to engineer a better world for all humanity.